OCCers. Welcome to the Early Risers Club. My name is Sarah Borges, and we're going to entertain you for the next 75 odd minutes. Uh, don't fall in the tub, don't fall off the boat, just fall in love with us. This song is called House on a Hill. another job, a job to keep me busy and money in my bank account, driving around as a delivery driver. And every so often I'd go to the airport and pick myself up a load, listen to some rock and roll, and drive around and deliver shit, stuff. And Roscoe gave me the great idea of writing a lady truck driver song, aptly titled, She's a Trucker, and that's the name of this next number. <laughs>
Some of you on the seventh floor last night over in the lounge that we've all created. Do you know about this? There were so many dang people on that side of the boat, I was afraid we were going to capsize. <laughs> the smoke was so thick, I was afraid we were going to evaporate. And that's what OCC is all about having a wonderful time that you don't have to remember when you get home. <laughs> We're gonna play a rock and roll number for you. This is our record release show for Together Alone, the record that we just put out on February 18th. If you don't have it yet, you can get it at the merch booth on the in the library. And I think there's gonna have they're gonna have some down here too. But a uh, little rock and roll number about how trying to find true love is just like trying to win the lottery. Ain't never gonna happen. <laughs> Don't buy your house story we're going to talk more about it later on in the show but when the first round of announcements came out for this boat for the originally scheduled date I wasn't on it and I got a little worried but I was willing to take my lumps you know it's a pleasure and a privilege to be on here but then there was this huge groundswell from all you nice people in the Facebook community and all of a sudden I was on it so we're so grateful to you. We're going to talk more about that in a little bit. But for now, we're going to play you a song about murdering someone. <laughs> And uh, it turns the typical man kills lady murder ballad on its head. I'm going to kill the guy because that's what I do. It's called Headed Down. Really? I'm going to start? Yeah. One, two, one, two,
else you know Eric Roscoe Amble on the guitar and singing over here? He gonna play his own set over to the Spinnaker later on this evening. I'll be wearing another dress with other fake animal parts on it. I got this girdle on, man, I'll tell you. It's just squeezing the notes right out of me. But one day I went over to Roscoe's house and we had ourselves a little party, listening to some music, and he played me this next song. We learned it from Jimbo Mathis. It's called Take a Ride at the Red Light. And I'm gonna tune the guitar because I care about you fine people, I really do. <laughs> birthday all the way from Cumbria in the UK we've got a birthday person among us you want to sing okay you can sing while I tune this guitar you want to lead it sure everybody happy birthday to you happy John John Fantastic. Fantastic, I tell you. John, do you feel loved? I don't know if you caught John over to Ra Roger Allen Wade's joke time last night. He was a judge. He was the funniest fucking thing going. I never knew he had it in him. Really, really a, a true teller of sheep jokes. 
<laughs> right now, I'd like to sing a duet with Roscoe called Loose Talk. That's right. It's going to be good, too. It's a song that was sort of uh, shown to me by my guru, the late Lou Whitney, yeah. and it was originally cut by Bonnie and Buck Owens, and it's called Loose Talk. All right. Ready? Yeah. Jack it. Jack it. sunburn in Belize? Yeah. Anybody drink a alcoholic beverage in Belize? Yeah. Anybody drinking an alcoholic beverage right now? Yeah. You're the happiest people I've seen. Usually I'm from Boston. Every time I play in Boston, they stare at me like this, man. <laughs> Looking at their phone. They don't give a shit. You people are so attentive and lovely. We love you. Here's a song about going out on the town looking to pick up a hot man while wearing a dress just like this one. <laughs> Give me 
have a new song on our new record, Together Alone. What's the name of that record again, my friends and family? Together Alone. Together Alone, that's right, because we all spent that god dang pandemic together but yet alone, and it sucked, and now we're together again, and it's a happy occasion. This next song is off the record. It's called Pretty Christine, and it's about that lady at every party that you know who's just too cool to even talk to. She keeps to her own self, smokes cigarettes on the fire escape, and doesn't let the boys come near her. I just wish I was that kind of girl. I got no willpower. <laughs> Whenever you're ready, my friends. One, two, one, two.
Yesterday I woke up in the morning and I had not had any coffee yet. I just went and did the necessary things and my phone rang. It was Rodney Crowell. It wasn't really Rodney Crowell, it was a lady on the other end, but you know on your phone they have the little display. I almost shit, you know. I know what to do. I didn't know if I should answer in a fancy accent to make myself sound more educated and perhaps able to sing with Rodney Crowell, should he so desire. But it was just the lady who said wrong number. That's true. That's true. This next song is from our last record. It's called Lucky Rocks. And it's the story of how I went to see a witch in Salem, Massachusetts because I joined Match.com. The man who answered my ad said he wanted someone small and blonde. It's like, didn't you look at the fucking profile picture, man? I'm neither one of those things. But I went to a witch and she gave me some rocks to put in my pocket and empty under salt water, moonlight, and some other stuff. And it worked. I got myself a nice boyfriend now. And he doesn't want me to be either small or blonde. He likes me just the way I am.
Sunny Sweeney does a great version of it too. One of my favorite songs of all time. I hope we did it justice. If we didn't, don't you tell anyone. Well, this next song, Roscoe sent us a guitar riff over the telephone. He said, I've been working on this new guitar riff. Would you do me the favor of trying to finish it? I said, okay. And I turned around and wrote the worst song I ever wrote in my life. It was so bad that even I couldn't listen to it. But Roscoe was so kind, he really never said anything. But then Keith helped me try again to write version two. And it came out as this. Wouldn't know you, the story of that friend who just can't put the bottle down, just can't put the joint down. I mean, that's not a bad thing. We just wanted to dedicate a song to them.
That's in B, and I kept thinking about. I thought I was going. Yeah, I don't give a damn about my reputation. That's a real funny joke. This is a flashback. I know. I know. Rock and roll never dies. The stories. Uh, I'm from Boston, Massachusetts, and um, there's a band from Boston, Massachusetts, but their version of this song is the one I know best. You're going to know the grand version, too. It's called Cry One More Time, and it's a song that uh, I think you can all relate to. Everything's gone wrong. I need another view. That's the first two lines of the song. There you go.
special story, so I guess I'm going to go ahead and do it now. Over the break during the pandemic, we made ourselves a record. And Roscoe had devised a kind of MacGyver method of doing it. I'd play and sing into my phone. He'd take those tracks and find a drummer or a bass player or somebody else to help us out. We made a record that whole way. But it was very lonely, and I missed you. <laughs> and I know you miss seeing live music, too. But one of the best things that happened during the break is that you got me back on the boat. Yeah. And so I wrote you a song of thank you. It is called, of course, You Got Me On The Boat. Yeah. We're gonna play it now, but we're gonna film it too. And there's a singing part for you. It's so easy. All you have to say is, you got me on the boat. You think you can handle it? You got me on the boat! I'll lead you in song when it's time. But again, I can't say thank you enough to all these friends and family. New and old here on OCC. You're just the damn best.
so easy. You got me on the boat. And I'm gonna say, and I ain't never going home. You feel that way? Yeah. Let's try it. You sound like a bunch of land lovers at 1.30 on a Tuesday. <laughs> it's 1.30 on a Tuesday, but you're on a boat. So take that cocktail, take a good long swig, get your liquid courage up, and let's do it. You ready? You ready? t-shirt, support local music, and be good to yourselves. Thank you.